animating text in Apple Motion. It is very easy to animate text in Apple Motion. For example, let's look at my project. So I have this text. So you can animate the text in Apple Motion using these properties, but there's a better way. So if you go to behaviors, then you will see we have a lot of presets already here available for us to use. We can select this text basic and for example, let's add a slide in. So what does this slide in do is it animates the position of our text just like this. Let's look at the other text presets available for us. So text basic. We also have paid words like this. Let's look at it. Okay, another one. Track in. And lastly, this one, text subtle. Let's select any random text preset here. Okay, so it's quite easy to animate text in motion, but if we want to have more control on our text, what we need to do is go to behaviors, text animation, and select sequence text. So all of the presets we have seen here, or all of the presets you can see in here, is made up using the sequence text behavior. So for now, let's create a simple animation using the sequence text. I want to animate my text using the position. So first, let's select here on the parameter. Let's add a format and position. Next, let's adjust our starting position using this one. So I'm gonna want. I want my text to start from the bottom up. Okay, 300. Okay, as you can see, our text animates really slow. The reason for that is because our sequence text occupies the whole timeline if we want our animation for our text to speed up we need to trim our sequence text for example i'm gonna end my sequence text on the one second and then let's go to the first frame Now you can see that our text animation now is much faster compared to before. So the main idea when using sequence text is that the longer the sequence text, the slower it is and the shorter it, the sequence text, the faster the animation. However, there are times that even though your sequence text are quite long, the animation will be different because of the keyframes inside the sequence text. So another one, let's add some opacity for our text. So I'm gonna click here on the parameter, add format and opacity. So I'm gonna set the opacity to start at zero. And then we have another simple text animation so it's very easy to animate text in motion you can also explore other parameter in here so you can go to the format then adjust or select each one of this to your liking we also have the 3d if you have a 3d text also paste for this one up to here on the drop shadow then to remove a parameter here on the top you just click this drop down remove then format 
because we have selected format earlier let's remove rotation for now thank you for your time to watch this basic way on how to animate text in motion uh, see you again next time